Yes, let's read the, the scripture readings. This kind of last part of the title operatory sentences. I am. I hope you uh, get the blessing uh, through this. You know the God's word. Uh, words. Uh, returning, returning our tithe and giving our offering so is a genuinely rewarding part of worship. So in addition to providing the means for the continuation and the growth the, of the Lord's work. We symbolize our faithful stewardship of all that is His, as well as the giving of ourselves to the Lord, using spiritual commands and invitations for the offering core lens on authenticity, authenticity and the spiritual tone to that part of worship. The following passages provide an example of the type of scriptures that can be used. So that's why I'm just making the other uh, uh, part of uh, video here, uh, not include two previous, you know, the end part of the previous uh, uh, part. But I, 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 I'm praying to uh, make the. the uh, operatory sentences. Uh, hymnal number 894, 1st Chronicles 29, 11-13. Yours, O Lord, is the greatness and the power and the glory and the majesty and the splendor for everlasting. Everything in heaven and earth is Yours, yours, O oh Lord, is the kingdom you are exalted as head over all. Wealth and honor come from you. You are the ruler of all things. In your hands are strength and power to exalt and give strength to all. Now, our oh God, we give you thanks and praise your glorious name. Amen. In 895, uh, the book of Psalm 50, 10, 11, 11, uh, 10, 11, 14. All the animals in the forest are mine, and the cattle on thousands of hills, all the wild birds are mine. And all living things in the fears, let the giving of thanks be your sacrifice to God and give the, the Almighty all that you promised. Yeah, 896, the book of Psalm 54, 6. I will sacrifice a free will offering to you. I will praise your name, O Lord. For it is good. Amen. 897, the book of Psalm 56, 12 and 13. I must fulfill the vows I made you, God. I shall pay you my thank offerings, for you have rescued me from death to walk in the presence of God in the light of the living. And uh, uh, 898, the book of Psalm 96, 8. Praise the Lord's glorious name. Bring an offering and come into his temple. And uh, 899, Pro uh, Proverbs 3, 9. Honor the Lord with your wealth as the first charge on you, all your earnings. And 900, uh, yeah, Malachi, uh, Malachi uh, 3, 10. And bring the fruit, uh, bring the full tithes into the storehouse, that uh, there may be food in my house, 
and thereby put me to the test, says the Lord of hosts. If I will not open the windows of heaven for you and pour down for you on overflowing blessings. Overflowing blessing. And 901, Matthew 5, 16. Let your light to shine before men that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father who is in heaven. And 902, Romans 12, 6 through 8. We have different gifts. According to the grace given us, if a man's gift is pro pro prophes prophesying, let him use it in proportion to his face. If it is serving, let him serve. If it is teaching, let him teach. If it is encouraging, let him encourage. If it is uh, contributing to the needs of others, let him give generosity. If it is leadership, let him govern diligently. If it is uh, showing mercy, let him do it cheerfully. Amen. 903, 2 Corinthians 8, 3 and 5. They gave according to their means and beyond their means of their own free will. But first they gave, they gave themselves to the Lord. And 904, 2 Corinthians 8, 9. Remember how generous the Lord Jesus was. He was rich, but he became poor for your sake to make you rich out of his poverty. And 905, 2 Corinthians 9, 6 and 7. Remember, spare sowing, spare reaping. Ha, sow bountifully and you will reap bountifully. Each person should give as he has decided for himself. There should be no re reluctance, no sense of comparison. God loves us. Cheerful giver. 906, 2 Corinthians 9, 13 through 15. Many will give honor to God when they see how humbly you obey Him and how faithfully you confess the gospel of Christ and will thank Him for your liberal contribution to their need and to the general good. Thanks be to God for his gift beyond the wars. Amen. Yeah. Then we go to benediction is the last uh, uh, subject of the God's words. Yeah. Yes. May God bless all of you.